Recently, the Swarmer Tower has received a small buff, but is it any good now? Well, let's see. But first, keep in mind that the Swarmer works completely differently from any other tower. Whereas other towers do regular damage, the Swarmer doesn't do any damage. Instead, it does take damage for the bees it throws. This means if multiple Swarmers hit the exact same enemies, they won't do any damage, which significantly weakens the Swarmer's capabilities. So if you have the Swarmer, I suggest only getting up to 5 Swarmers and set them to random to make sure it hits as many different enemies as possible. Okay, with that yapping out of the way, let's get to level 0. So at level 0, the Swarmer's B damage is increased from 1 to 2, and the sting time is increased from 3 seconds to 4 seconds. This increases the Swarmer's total elapsed damage from 3 to 8, and its overall DPS from 1 to 2, making it significantly better at early game, now being able to kill normals and speedies in multi mode with just one shot. At level 1, the upgrade cost was increased by $50, now costing $600 total. Although the B damage is increased from 1 to 2, which increases its total lapse damage from 5 to 10, and its overall DPS from 1.3 to 2.67 DPS. At level 2, the upgrade cost is increased by another $50, now costing $950 total. The B damage is increased from 1 to 2, and the fire rate is decreased from 2 seconds to 1.5 seconds. The total lapse damage is now increased from 5 to 10, and the total DPS is increased from 1.3 to 2.67. At level 3, the upgrade cost is $500, costing a total of $1,450. The B damage is increased from 1 to 2, and the total lapse damage is increased from 5 to 10, and the total DPS is increased from 1.3 to 2.67. Now you might be confused on why the Swarmer has the same DPS from levels 1 to 3, it's because even with the faster fire rate, the Swarmer doesn't do any extra damage since it does damage over time. At level 4, the upgrade cost is increased by $200, now costing $2,850 total. The B damage is increased from 2 to 4, increasing the total elapsed damage from 24 to 48, increasing its DPS from 4 to 8 total. And the Swarmer gains the Beehive ability on this level. The Beehive ability throws a Beehive bomb that deals 10 damage in a 10 explosion radius, and stings every enemy in the radius, and has a 50 second cooldown. And at max level, the upgrade cost is now $4,000, now costing a total of $6,850 total. The B damage is increased from 4 to 6, increasing the total lapse damage from 128 to 192, and the overall DPS from 16 to 24 DPS. Even after the Swarmer buff, Swarmer is still the worst tower in the entire game since it can't deal any damage to enemies that are already being stung by bees, which limits its single target DPS to 24 DPS. So even if you place down 40 Swarmers, it would still only deal 24 DPS, easily making it the worst tower in the entire game, even worse than Scout or Paintballer. So for that, I ranked the Swarmer an F-tier tower. Literally never use it unless you want to make your game 10 times harder. 